Yes, hello, it's me. Welcome back to my house. Mi casa es tu casa. Listen, today we are going to watch Rambo First Blood. Excuse me, I can't see. Okay. Another Sylvester Stallone movie. And I am actually curious to see if this character is going to be different from Rocky, which I watched recently. And you can watch that reaction somewhere here. You can click here, here. I never know when it's gonna, where it's gonna pop up. Yes, you can watch that if you would like to. And <laughs> we're gonna watch Rambo today. So let's uh, roll it. He's a bad boy, baby. Wah, wah. Listen, I'm not going to lie. The phrase first blood makes me think about period. I mean, I mean, come on. Why is it called first blood? Oh, there he is. Oh, wow. That's so pretty. Look at that hair. <laughs> that looks very pretty. This is based on a novel. I had no idea. Excuse me, can you tell me this where Delmar Barry lives? He ain't here. Delmar. Oh, he's a friend of mine. As a matter of fact, he wrote this address down. What a nice little town. Uh, my name is John Rambo. We served on the same oh. team together in Nam. Rambo is his last name. Okay, Rambo. I thought it was like a nickname or something. That's me. That's uh, Danforth and Westmore, Bronson, Ortega. I don't think this lady cares about this. Delmar's gone. Uh, As in dead? He died. Oh. Why didn't she, she just say that? Died how? Cancer. Brought it back from man. All that orange stuff that spread it around. Cut him down to nothing. I could lift him off the sheet. <gasps> Very sorry. So he's walking back home. Can't wait to holiday land. I like how that burp was included. <laughs> I don't think it's very safe to Morning. walk on the road like that. You visiting somebody around here? You know, wearing that flag and that jacket, looking the way you do. You're asking for trouble around here, friend. Why? Why? I'll jump in. I'll make sure you're heading the right direction, huh? He looks a little lost. But not like lost geographically, but just in life, you know? You got some place I can eat around here? There's a diner about 30 miles up the highway. Is there any law against me getting something here? Yeah, me. What? Why are you pushing me? First of all, you don't ask the questions around here, I do. What? What is this guy? We don't want guys like you in this town. Like what? Drifters. First thing you know, we got a whole bunch of guys like you in this town. That's why. It's a quiet little town. In fact, you might say it's boring, but that's the way we like it. Oh, that town is gonna blow up <laughs> by the end of this movie. Is it? I really like this um, scenery. This is my kind of stuff, you know. I don't like the heat. I don't like. I don't like summer. I there. I said it. I said it. Hope this ride helped you out. You have a nice day, huh? What a weird guy. He's coming in. <laughs> he has the right to come in. Hey, I'm talking to you, goddamn. It's his right. All right, you're under arrest. For what? Now you put your hands on the car and you spread them. Now you're gonna put your hands on that car. What the fuck? How you do it, you decide, right now! Get your legs back. Get them back! Hey, try to be nice to some people. Nice? You call that nice? Looks more like harassment. Why would you be carrying a knife like this? That is a huge knife. Hunting. What do you hunt with a knife? Name it. Paint on the canvas now. Hey, Will. 
Just another smart ass drifter. He wanted to get rid of him and now he brought him back for a stay. Your name? Your name! What? If you're looking for trouble. He has PTSD. You came to the right place, buddy. God, wait a second. What are they gonna do? They're gonna they're gonna Hey, you got three seconds before I break your face in. Oh, what is this? What is this police? Wait, well, you know about the old Harry here is a soldier. You gotta talk to me. I promise you're gonna talk to me, soldier. This is I'm starting to dislike you. This whole police department is f***ed up. I'm gonna run a make on him. Put his name in the teletype. That's the guy from CSI Miami. What are you? He won't let us print him well. Leave the ink on the hand. Now listen, hard ass. As things stand right now, you're facing the ass end of a 90 day incarceration plus a $250 fine, which you don't look to me like you can pay. He doesn't even look that bad. At 10 o'clock tomorrow morning, you're going up in front of that judge. Now we're going to make you a little bit more presentable for your courtroom appearance. Now clean him up. All right, Preston, I want you to go over and get that hose ready. Hose? Wait a minute, what? All right, put your hands on top of your head and turn around. Oh, huh? Christ. We should report this to Teasel, Galt. Look at that. What happened? <laughs> Galt, what the fuck was that? He just felt like doing that. Clean him up. This is horrible, and it's... It's kind of hard to watch. Don't forget to get in behind the ears. I thought this was jail, not, you know, the penitentiary. All right, hurry it up. It's time for my coffee break. All right, sit down. Sit down. Oh, sit down. What happened to him? What the f*** happened? How blind are you? Can't you see this guy's crazy? Can't you see? I don't give a shit. He's not crazy. He's just... Traumatized. I'm just gonna shave your partner. Take it easy. Is this necessary? Of course not. Come on! Don't move. I don't want you to cut your own throat. <gasps> they triggered him. <laughs> I don't know if that was meant to be funny. He killed that guy. <laughs> he made his way out of there with the cheer power of his fists. I right, get help. I'll go after him. <gasps> yes, please leave fast. I want to know his origin story. <gasps> oh no. I mean, yeah, the sheriff knows the, the, the place. <gasps> oh, dude. Oh, dude. <laughs> that was such a slow car wreck. Poor guy has been through a lot already, and the movie is just starting out. I know you can hear me! You're finished! You've gone as far as you're gonna go! <laughs> Don't tell me he's going to jump. <gasps> wow. I mean, he would die. He could sleep at any time. <gasps> no, no, no. I mean, he's obviously not going to die, but in real life, he, yeah, he would die.
there's rocks down there he i mean i already said this but he could die if he falls or jumps there he is, on the <gasps> they found him oh no he's going to jump he is This, I think this is illegal. <laughs> what are you doing? We're just supposed to spot him. Yeah. Jesus, God, he's stuck there. He can't go anyplace. If you don't buy this thing, right? I swear to God, I will kill you. The f is wrong with these people in this town? I got it. He's going to do it. He's going to go for it. He didn't even aim for the water. <laughs> oh my god. Don't tell me he broke a rib. Oh no, they spotted him again. Oh no. <laughs> oh my god. How is he gonna get out of here? I really don't want him to get caught he keeps shooting son of a listen oh, beautiful love to see it you know you play stupid games you get stupid prizes Go, 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 go! Wow! <laughs> he needs to go! Oh, good idea! I mean, I'm not sure what he's doing, but good idea! Jesus Christ! Give me the binoculars, sir! Oh, no, no, no! Shh! He did that to himself! Good God. Look at that blood flow. Oh my God. I can't. I wanted to see more of that. I'm not gonna lie. There's nearly suckers as he can't be fired. Will. Looks like he wants to turn himself in. Stand right where you are. Give yourself up. But I didn't do anything. <gasps> They're shooting. They hit him. It had to be superficial, though. Go ahead, Will. Lester, we're down in the gorge. Galt's dead, all right. Where the hell is that goddamn chopper? I don't want Galt's body out here all night. I'll do what I can. Listen, Will. You sure pick one a hell of a guy to mess around with. John Rambo is a Vietnam vet. He's a Green Beret, Congressional Medal of Honor. Guy's a war hero. Okay. Those Green Berets, they're real badasses. Why don't you let the state police handle this? Oh my god, this guy's... <gasps> Look at him! He and I were friends when your mama was still wiping your nose! Now he's dead. He's dead because of that psycho out there. Now you listen, boy. Oh, he's you the psycho. Good, I'm gonna get that son of a bitch. And I'm gonna pin that Congressional Medal of Honor to his liver. Oh, it turned personal for him now. There he is! Where? Turn those dogs loose, Trouble! Let's go get him, sweethearts! There's your dinner! Oh, it's a dummy. <laughs> God damn it, I'm hit! Jesus, he's got a gun. Get him! Go get him! Go get him, mate! I hope the dogs don't get hurt. Oh, come on. Look at his leg. Bitch, get your belt. Get a tourniquet around that. We gotta get this guy to a doctor. We oh, damn it, get your belt around there fast. Where's the first aid kit? I left it in the car. Shit. Where'd you get the gun? I mean, our Galt's gun. You gotta stay awake, all right? You gotta release that tourniquet every 15 minutes. We'll be right back. If that guy dies, it's on him. <laughs> <laughs> wow. 
That was professional. He's wounding them, not killing them. This makes me think of Predator. Oh, there he is. Wow. What the hell is going on? So if he incapacitates each and every one of them, he still can escape. You know, he doesn't have to kill them. So I, I get it, I guess. He shot his colleague. Signal it, follow me. I got it. Somebody help me. A bear trap. Oh, nobody can help you, honey. Oh, baby, no, nah, that ain't gonna no. work. Signal it over here. They need to call this whole thing off. Come on, don't they have families? Give me out here, I hope. <laughs> he could bleed out. I want to see the damage. I, too bad it's too dark. <laughs> what? When did he do that? I could have killed them all. I could have killed you. In town, you're the law. Out here, it's me. Yeah. Don't push it. Don't push it. I'll give you a war you won't believe. He already pushed it. In my opinion. Let it go. All your men are wounded. And you're crying in the woods. It's time to call it off. Leave it alone. I hope he escaped, please. <laughs> The headlines. One man did all of this. I'm a possessed god in heaven to make a man like Rambo. God didn't make Rambo. I made him. Who the hell are you? Excuse me? What? Colonel Samuel Trotman. What does that mean? Oh, he trained him? I've come to get my boy. Your boy? I recruited him. I trained him. I commanded him in Vietnam for three years. I'd say that makes him mine. Rambo's a civilian now. He's my problem. I don't think you understand. I didn't come here to rescue Rambo from you. The other way around. I came around. here to rescue you from him. Well, we all appreciate your concern, Colonel. And we'll try to be extra careful. This guy has an ass face. I'm sorry, but he was very well cast. You don't seem to want to accept the fact that you're dealing with an expert in guerrilla warfare. With a man who's the best. With guns, with knives, with his bare hands. He is. A man who's been trained to ignore pain. Can you be trained to ignore pain? I would like to know more about that. Vietnam, his job was to dispose of enemy personnel. To kill, period. Well, Rambo was the best. Oh, he's hunting. Is he gonna live there? Are you gonna live in the woods? There is no salt in there. Cover leader calling Raven. Cover leader to Raven. Talk to me, Johnny. How was the relationship between him and Troutman? Talk to me, Johnny. Because if they didn't have a good relationship, he's not going to respond. They're all gone, sir. It's him. It's him. Get on it. Rambo, are you all right? Over. Baker team, they're all dead, sir. Not Delmore Barry. He made it. Barry's gone too, sir. I'm the last one, sir. Mm. Hey, it's good to hear your voice, Johnny. It's been a long time. Look, John, you've done some damage That's here. It. But they don't want any more trouble. He's northwest. That's why I've come. They're locating him. I'm gonna come in there and fly you the hell out. Just you and me. Can he trust that they are going to let him do that? I wish I was back at Bragg now. We'll talk about that when you come in. I can't do that, sir. Well, look, John, we can't have you running around out there wasting friendly civilians. There are no friendly civilians. Well, I'm your friend, Johnny. I covered your ass more than once. Seems like bailing you out of trouble is gonna be a lifetime job for me. There wouldn't be no trouble except for that king shit cup. Or one of us up to me. Yeah. <laughs> but the man kept pushing, sir. Well, you did some pushing of your own, John. He didn't. They drew first blood, not me. Oh, well, that's what it means. They drew first blood. Okay, I get it. Now, it sounds like a completely different thing. Rambo, are you still reading me? But what do you want to do, Rambo? What do you want to do? There he is! 
also they are they just want to kill him i see Did he kill all of them? Huh? What? Keep firing! Come on, guys! Shoot! Come on! They're dead. Huh? All right, Steve. Yo. I want you and Bruce head around these trees. Go to the front of that mine. Screw that, Clinton. I ain't going up there. No way. Oh, they're not dead. I thought he shot them all. Right, Rambo! This is Lieutenant Clinton Morgan. Now I'm giving you just three zero seconds to come on out. Or what? Who's got the rocket launcher? Oh, okay. Now fire that thing. Just let me get out of the way first. Oh no. That's gonna kill him. <gasps> Where did he go? Now he's trapped there. I don't like this. And there's, there's water in there. I don't like this. Rats? <laughs> no. <laughs> They're huge. <laughs> At least he didn't drop that fire thing. Excellent. Good for him. Jesus. Wow. Am I too far from the screen? Yes, I am. I'm sorry. Just my back is killing me. Don't look at me. Look at the road. That's how accidents happen. <laughs> What's your name? Cathcart, Robert A. All right. What do you got in the back, Robert A? M60. I don't know what that is. Okay, Robert oh, A, please. get out of the truck. I got no beef with you. No. Go on, move, no, go on. Oh, he's gonna tell everybody that he's alive. Looks like somebody pulled the plug too soon. That Rambo guy is on the loose again. Shit. <laughs> hey, Will, it, it's Rambo. He's still around. That guy's head is gonna blow up. <gasps> he's coming out. What are they gonna do to him? <laughs> what is he doing? What is he gonna do? Why? Why? Right, get out there right away. Move! Is he sending a message? <laughs> this guy's gonna cry. Watch yourself! We're all gonna blow! We're all gonna blow. Remember when I said earlier that the town was gonna blow up? <laughs> oh, that town is gonna blow up <laughs> by the end of this movie. Rambo is probably already there. He saw him. <laughs> wow, dude. <laughs> I don't think he's dead. I think he's he's just wounded. Yeah. Oh my god. Is he gonna kill him? Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead, you crazy son of a bitch. Finish. Rambo! Rambo, don't do it. Yeah, don't do it. He deserves it, but don't do it. Because then he's gonna be the man who shot the sheriff. Think about what you're doing. 
building perimeter is covered. No exit. There are nearly 200 men out there and a lot of M16s. This mission is over, Rambo. Do you understand me? This mission is over! Nothing is over! Nothing! You just don't turn it off! It wasn't my war! You asked me, I didn't ask you! And I come back to the world, and I see all those maggots at the airport protesting me, spitting? Oh, okay. Who are they to protest me, huh? Unless they've been me and been there and know what the hell they're yelling about? You're the last of an elite group. Don't end it like this. Back there, I can fly a gunship. I was in charge of million dollar equipment. Back here, I can't even hold the job. Fucking guys! Ah! Oh, wow. I wasn't expecting this loaded message from this movie. I had all these guys, man. Back there, I had all these fighting guys. Who were my friends? Because back here, there's nothing. Remember Dan Forrest? We went to this bar in Saigon, and this kid comes up. This kid came to see a shine box. And he says, uh, shine, please, shine. I said, no, and he kept asking, yeah. And Joey said, yeah. And I went to get a couple of beers, and the, the box is wired. And he opened up the box, fucking blew his body all over the place. He's laying there, he's fucking screaming, there's pieces of him all over me. Just like, my friend, it's all over me. Oh my god, oh my god. I put them together, his fucking insides keep coming out. My god. Nobody went out. No one helped me say, please, I want to go home, I want to go home. We keep calling my leg. I want to go home, Johnny. I want to drive my Chevy. I said, well, what? I can't find your fucking legs. I can't get out of my head. I can't lose seven years. Every day it happens. I wasn't expecting this from this movie at all. I don't talk to anybody. Sometimes a day, last week. I can't put it out of my mind. And then he came to, to see his friend and his friend was dead. Del Delmar. <laughs> I didn't expect this realness from this movie. <laughs> wow, 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 wow. My god, he just needed to be hurt. It's a long road when you're on your Okay, wow. Listen, that was such an unex ex unexpected ending. Uh, the movie took such an unpredictable turn because I never expected this guy to you know sit down and break down and open up like that and what a message you know i'm not even sure i i have the knowledge to give my opinion on everything he said but the way he spoke about being judged by other people who don't even know what's going on there in the war i mean i'm not gonna <laughs> speak on the consequences of war and war related violence because i don't think i have the knowledge to do that but I didn't expect this movie to to have some strong political message attached to it. And Stallone's performance was, I think it was good. Wow, it really makes you think about what these people go through when they are sent overseas and then when they come back. I still don't think any of the things that happen were his fault, you know? He was literally just walking when he was picked up by the sheriff and and then he was abused and he just responded to that that was good and it was entertaining i already want to watch part two like what is it gonna be about this was so well-rounded i can't imagine what the next one could be about but i want to watch it <laughs> already so that's it for today's video thank you for watching and thank you if you made it this far um i'm gonna rest my back now because it's hurting so much i have to figure out what how to you know give myself some support with this new setting by the way i got some cool lights over here i don't know if you can see them um my back if you watched this video and you enjoyed it you can make a one-time donation by using the thanks button which is down here somewhere and i guess that's it for today thank you so much again and i'll see you in the next video 